Welcome to this Vipassana meditation for beginners on Declutter the Mind. Vipassana, which is also known as insight meditation, is a mindfulness practice that encourages you to develop self-awareness and cultivate a deep understanding of the nature of reality. And so by focusing on your breath and observing the sensations of your body, you'll gradually build a foundation for deeper insights and personal transformation. And so before we begin, find a quiet space where you can sit comfortably for the next 20 minutes, and you may sit on a cushion or a chair or any other comfortable surface that allows you to maintain an upright posture. Ensure that your back is straight but not tense and your head is facing forward. Let's begin. Begin by closing your eyes gently. Start by taking in a few deep breaths, inhaling slowly through your nose and exhaling through your mouth. Allow your body to relax as you breathe in and out. And with each exhale, release any tension or discomfort in your body, allowing yourself to sink into a state of calm and relaxation. Notice the weight of your body on the surface beneath you, grounding you into the present moment. And now allow your breath to return to its natural rhythm, simply observing it as it flows in and out all on its own. And as you continue to observe your breath, let's bring our attention to the top of the head, noticing any sensations here such as tingling or pressure, and then gradually moving our attention down to the face, to the neck, shoulders, and gently scanning for any areas of tension here. And continue to scan the body, moving down to your chest, to your abdomen, to your lower back, observing any sensations, whether pleasant or unpleasant, without judgment or resistance. Allow your awareness to flow through your body like a gentle stream, releasing any tension as it moves along.
And move your attention down to your hips, to your thighs, to your knees, to your lower legs. And notice any sensations in the body here. And allow them to simply be without trying to change or control them. And finally, bring your awareness to your feet, feeling the sensations in your toes, soles, and heels. Take a moment to appreciate your body as a whole, experiencing each part connected and unified. And now let's gently bring our attention back to the breath, back to the body breathing on its own, observing the natural rhythm of your breathing without trying to control or alter it in any way. Focus on the sensation of the air entering your nostrils and then the subtle rise and fall around your chest and abdomen with each inhale and exhale. And as you maintain your attention on your breath, you may find that your mind begins to wander. And this is completely normal. When you notice your mind has wandered, gently acknowledge the thought or distraction, and then return your attention to the breath. There's no need to judge yourself here or feel frustrated. Simply notice the thoughts as they arise and allow them to pass like clouds in the sky before returning your attention to your breath. And so, in Vipassana meditation, cultivating equanimity is essential. 
And equanimity is the ability to maintain an even-tempered, balanced state of mind, regardless of the sensations or thoughts that arise during meditation. And so as you continue to observe your breath, also pay attention to the sensations in your body and the thoughts that arise here. And then treat each experience with an attitude of equanimity, allowing them to arise and pass without getting caught up in the content or reacting to them. And so when a pleasant sensation arises, notice it without clinging to it or craving more of it. And then when an unpleasant sensation arises, notice it without aversion or resistance. We want to practice accepting these sensations with an open, non-judgmental awareness. And now apply the same approach to your thoughts. And so when a thought arises, whether it's positive or negative, observe it without getting lost in the story or reacting to it. And so to help here, we can gently label the thought as thinking and then return our attention to the breath. And as you practice equanimity, you may find that your mind becomes more or less reactive to the ever-changing nature of your experiences. This calm, balanced state of mind will help serve as a foundation for developing insight and understanding through your Vipassana practice. And as you continue to focus on your breath, you may notice various thoughts and emotions arising in your mind. And in Vipassana meditation, our goal is to observe these mental events without getting caught up in their content or in the story we attach to them. So when a thought or emotion arises, again, we simply acknowledge it and label it such as thinking 
or feeling. And then gently bring our attention back to the breath. There is no need here to judge or analyze these thoughts and emotions. Simply observe them as they arise and then pass away. And remember that the purpose of Vipassana is to cultivate self-awareness and a deeper understanding of the nature of our minds. And so by observing your thoughts and emotions with non-attachment, you are practicing the skill of seeing things as they truly are, without the filter of your own beliefs or perceptions, or stories. And as we continue now to the final moments of this meditation practice, let's just gently bring our attention back to the breath, back to continuing to observe the natural rhythm of our breathing, using our breath to help us anchor into the present moment. And just take a moment here to appreciate the peace and clarity that comes from simply being present with your breath. Remembering that we can return to this practice and to this place whenever we need a moment of stillness and insight. And as we conclude this Vipassana meditation, Take a moment now to reflect on your experience. Acknowledge any insights or discoveries you may have had and express gratitude for the time that you've dedicated to your self-awareness and personal growth. And slowly bringing our attention back to the surroundings, noticing any sounds or sensations in the room. And then whenever you feel ready, slowly open your eyes. And as you continue your journey into Vipassana meditation, Remember that it's a gradual process of self-discovery and transformation. With constant practice, you can develop greater mindfulness, equanimity, and insight into the nature of your own mind and the world around you. Thank you for joining me today in this Vipassana meditation practice, and I'll see you next time. Thanks again for taking the time to practice. 
If you've enjoyed this practice, please be sure to like and subscribe. You can also join and become a member and receive access to courses and more. Head on over to declutterthemind.com for more and download our free iOS and Android app.